you're using Proctorio in your course, you may want to let students know some of the common pitfalls so that they can avoid them as they begin setting up their computers. Now, I've seen professors and I've seen students alike make some of these mistakes, so in order to not offend anybody, I decided to let my three-year-old son demonstrate a few of these things for you. First is lighting. Make sure you don't have a huge window or bright light behind you. Is my background too light? It will make your face dark. Try to sit with a lamp or window in front of you if Proctorio is having issues detecting your face. Glasses. Sometimes the program can have issues seeing your eyes if you have glasses on. Now don't panic, just take them off for the picture and then put them right back on so you can see your exam. Sunglasses? Well, you're gonna need to take those off for the duration of the exam. No sunglasses? Sometimes students have issues getting their ID to register properly within Proctorio. Usually it's more of a strange sort of up, down, left, right problem that they have. But I have seen people try to put it on the computer screen, so just be aware to let them know that they have to put it in front of the camera. If your students don't have cameras on their computer, please let them know they can come to the library and borrow a computer during that test time. Hopefully these tips will help your students more successfully set up Proctorio on their computers. If not, and you have other issues, please contact us at Olitz and we can help you out.